Alfred, call Tiffany and tell her to get to the manor. Harley escaped with a virus. Right away. Get me a proper lockdown crew in here, Stat. I want bioscans on freeze. Do not let him out of that airlock. Move it, people! Good work here, Batman. Good work? Harley escaped with the Lotus virus. Your girlfriend Catwoman is nowhere to be found. Same goes for your boy John. So if good work means half the pact is loose in Gotham, and we've got a megavirus in the hands of a psychopath, then yes, this is picture perfect. Oh, I could think of some more colorful words to describe this situation. You didn't offer much help. It was up to your people to stop them. I did my is job. Is that so? Both of you, please. Sanctus, right under our noses all this time. Chemical weapons, human experimentation. Sanctus was, is, the darkest part of the Agency's history. Oh, this place is just evil. And that's why we're shutting it down once and for all. We can take some of this equipment and put it to good use. This facility needs to be burned to the ground. I don't want so much as a trace of it left in my city. Why don't you let me worry about that, Batman? I'm gonna need your help tracking down Quinn. She's out there with the virus, and that's a threat to Gotham we simply can't allow. Freeze must have an idea about where she'd go in these circumstances. <laughs> don't waste your time with that maniac. He'd say anything to throw us off track. But he's our best lead. Well, I disagree. Freeze is nothing more than a science experiment gone awry. You best keep your focus on Harley and the virus before anyone else gets hurt. That was strange. She just completely shut me down. She's normally so open to all possible leads. This is so unlike her. Waller was out of line. She should know better than to ignore your instincts. Usually, she does. Listen, Director Waller may think it's a waste of time, but I say leave no stone unturned. I'll see what I can find out. Hey, Will. Give me a hand with this, will you? I think there may be something we can salvage back here. deserve this. You need help, Freeze. <laughs> you think? I'm here to talk about Harley Quinn. I need your help to find her. If you want me to tell you what I know about Harley, I'm going to need something from you in exchange. If the agency intends to keep me prisoner with this virus living inside me. They mean to study me. Given the chance, I could beat this just like Riddler. He became stronger for it. You're saying Riddler became infected with the Lotus virus when he worked for Sanctus. If he could survive it, I believe I can too. <clears throat> That dial, there, they've keyed it into the temperature regulators in the airlock. All I need from you is to turn that dial. Let my body do the rest. Lower the temperature in the airlock. 
I know that I can fight this. I will do that for you. But first, tell me what you know. I'm so glad you're agreeable. The truth is, the Lotus Virus doesn't have to be this. Riddler's blood can turn the virus into something that can heal. That's why we stole his body. Why your friends in the agency had it on ice. My Nora will perish if I don't use the Lotus to save her. Bane merely hoped to cure himself of his addiction. Harley already has the virus. Now, she needs a blood sample from Riddler's body. With it, she will have what she needs to create the serum. She'll go for the body first. That's how you will find her. I already have samples of the blood. Look for a temperature-controlled container. No. You have what you came for. Please, do as you promised. I need to get to the subway right away. If Harley's trying to make this serum, she'll go straight for Riddler's blood. I'm coming with you. The secondary properties of this virus. The serum they want to make from it. I've got a feeling Director Waller didn't want us to hear that. Which would explain why she steered you away from Freeze. What is she up to, I wonder? Waller always operates on some hidden agenda. Surprised you're only just realizing. I... I guess I'm not. Just realizing, that is. I guess I just have blinders on when it comes to people I look up to. Don't worry about that now. If we hurry, we can intercept Harley at the lair. We could use Bruce on this one. The less attention we draw to ourselves, the better. What does that mean? If Harley sees Batman coming, she may do something drastic. But if she sees Bruce... She'll think she can take you. Um, about the whole Bruce Batman thing. I know it was you that told Waller. Are, are we... Are we all good? I'd like to clear the air. In the interest of full transparency. Sure. We're good. Oh. <sighs> all right then. I suppose I should have seen this coming. She's become more and more erratic since she came to Gotham. I hardly know what she's going to do next. Harley? No. Director Waller. I'm not used to her keeping me out of the loop. Ah! Damn! Ow! Ah, the hell is wrong with this thing? Oh, damn it, sorry. I, I... I've got a passive anti-surveillance system running. It must have triggered What did your... you say, Bruce? Looked like you were speaking, but can't hear so well without these. I, I was saying I'm sorry. Crappy agency technology. Not your fault. You know what I mean. Look, it's fine. I'd just rather not talk about it. I have to admit... A part of me was sort of hoping we'd be taking the Batmobile. 
Not that this car isn't great. But, you know, it's no Batmobile. Oh, we are taking it. I don't follow. I push a button, the armor plates flip, and voila. Batmobile. That's incredible. If you're not just pulling my leg. Yeah. Lucius Fox was a genius. You've put a lot of time and energy into this crusade. I prefer to think of it as a mission. Do you ever question it? Not the mission. I mean, the methods. The clandestine nature of what you do. The fear tactics. The occasional brutality. No judgment. Just curious. I've held myself back. And I'm doing my best to protect this city. That's not... And you've hardly got a leg to stand on. I mean, the agency has done some pretty brutal things itself. No! God! Bruce, stop! I'm not criticizing. Quite the opposite. I'm having a bit of an existential crisis. Existential crisis? <sighs> yeah. It's... Waller. Why wouldn't she want us to know what Freeze told you? Things have gotten gray recently. Too gray. I don't know if I'm on the right side anymore. Maybe I shouldn't have brought this up. You should trust your instincts. They're what make you good at your job. I'm glad to hear you say that. It bothered me when she allowed the pack to obtain Riddler's body. Wait, that was intentional? I've had deep reservations about Waller. <laughs> Can't believe I just said that out loud. If you don't believe in what you're doing there, you should quit. And then what? Maybe we can work together on that. You mean that? I'll definitely keep that in mind. Hey, you sure you're okay to do this? Absolutely. You know, I looked through Gordon's case files about Harley. Her father suffered from mental illness that eventually drove him to suicide. An illness with a strong hereditary link. It's very possible she wants the serum to prevent the same thing happening to her. If she fails, she's got one deadly plan B. <laughs> Don't sound so worried, Batman. I'm here to help. We're almost there. Freeze me to death. Then we're on the same page. <laughs> 